This is a simple example of using the new Goda Core Portal system in 3.4. This room I downloaded from Sketchfab and is called Viking Dining Hall by Rungsted. I added four boxes in the editor to form a wall with an opening and an omni light to light scene. I made a duplicate of the room and placed them so that they face each other with the opening in between. In order to enable the portal system to see between rooms, we need to place a portal between them. This starts life as a machine instance placed in either of the rooms, usually a plane. The machine instance should be named portal underscore, followed by either the name of the room you wish it to link to, or leave the name blank for the system to automatically detect the linked room. Position the plane so it covers the opening and faces outwards from the source room. If you look at the rest of the scene tree, you will notice that the room geometry is inside a spatial which is named room, then underscore, then the name you want to use for the room. Here I have simply used A and B. The rooms are then in turn placed under another spatial, which I have called here the room list. You should also add the new room manager node to the scene. It is responsible for dealing with the portal system at runtime, and you will need to assign the room list in the room manager inspector so it knows where the rooms are. In the simple case, all the hard work is now done. When you select the room manager node, a new button appears in the editor, the convert button. When you click this button, or run the room's convert function from script, the system will build the date necessary to use the room system at runtime. In the editor pressing convert allows you to preview the system. It can be a good idea to switch the editor to wireframe mode so you can see the objects being called. Although this example is incredibly simple, even placing a single portal in a game level can sometimes allow you to call out half of your objects, and greatly increase performance. Each room and portal you add will increase performance again, it is totally up to you how you use the system. There are some caveats however. Your rooms must approximately form a convex hull, so the system can easily work out which room a camera is in. As you experiment with the system you will learn ways of building levels that work well with the system. You can build an entire level in Blender or similar, including rooms and portals.